Hey, what is up, Eater Kitty Clan? Eater Kitty John back with another episode of I Am Setsuna for the PS4. As I said, we ended up um, finding out more about Eight or Julianne is her name, I believe. She is going crazy. She has two different types of magic powers, apparently, and I'm not sure ex what exactly is happening, but it seems like she's not able to handle that. Um, and she's turning progressively more evil. We also found out that the guy that who's asked us to kill Setsuna is like her right hand man. I'm wondering if that has something to do with it. But right now, um, what we're trying to do is we're trying to find a. We have to go to Fulberg Waters. We're trying, we have to find a monster that can give us this Sprite Knight thing that we need in order to be able to save Julianne. I'm assuming that after we do that, she'll probably join our party because I believe she does. All right, let's do this. So this monster called a Scarly has a Sprite Knight, right? His shadow would be down to luck, which means you don't necessarily have one. Let's do our best. Oh, let's do our best. Lily, Lily's counting on us too. Words, that's enough. Let's do our best. So we need to find a Scarly. Is this, are these guys Scarlys? Uh, we'll find out. Ah, uh, we seriously need mana. Now these are spikoons. So let's just uh, murder some spikoons here. Uh, let's provoke. And let's do a cyclone and hopefully knock these guys all back. Yeah, back the fuck up. Back up! Um, is there a technique we can do in order to kill all of them? Let's bring them all together. Yeah, there we go. Actually guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bounce out real quick, save, and uh, use a tent, because I think we need to. So I'll be right back as soon as we do that. Okay, so we are back. Um, I actually wanted to show you guys this part where I actually equipped their weapons and show you what they look like. This is the thing Endear has been, ha been holding on to, which is pretty dope, but this Demon Slayer thing looks dope. A, slight, a light sword forged in ancient times, this blade stores a huge amount of magical energy, and it possesses extremely high magical attack power. Forgot that we actually did a lot of shopping and stuff at the end of the episode, and I didn't actually show you guys this stuff. It's weird, it looks like a, a Sinaeus light gun in a way. Surprised it's a sword, it looks like a rifle of some sort. Anyway, let's give Eterna her rune blade. A uh, chaos rune blade? Look at this. The knife is dope looking. She uses knives. And then we have this fucking beast thing. We have the rune blade and then the defender blade. This thing looks crazy. It looks like some sort of like dragon thing. Uh, we didn't actually read uh, her her knife's like name thingy. Um, or her knife's description. A knife once used in a ritual to ward off evil spirits, its blade contains the power of many such rites which boosts the wielder's maximum MP. Oh wow! This boosts her MP! Damn, I should've equipped this- I should've uh, equipped this before I used the, um, tent, because now she has- she's down 20 MP. Anyway, Defender Blade, a broadsword made to be able to deflect attacks as well as unbeatable physical defense power. As well as its unbeatable def physical defense power, it also boosts as well as evasion rate. Oh cool, so if we can get him like to be really fast and like really evasive, um, and we provoke him so like maybe nullify most monsters attacks, uh, we have to fight these guys again, I think. So if we go this way, won't we like get lost or whatever? We don't want that, right? Okay, let's let's go on Endear. Yeah, let's just do our cyclone and see if we can murder them all in one hit. Boom. No? Really? Not all of them? Let's try to just attack. Oh. Not quite sure why we didn't kill them in one shot, but that works, whatever, regardless. Oh, we got another flux power from Cyclone. Unscathed power. Sweet. So Cyclone has a lot of different fluxes on it. <laughs> I don't know if that means that other items can't get fluxes on them, but... Uh, I'm assuming not. Um, we actually didn't put any of the Sprite Knight that we bought on these guys, so I'm gonna take a moment and do that, guys. We'll be right back as soon as I put Sprite Knight on people. Please? 
Alright guys, we're back. I apologize. We're just taking some time to, uh... Alpha my party correctly. A lot of people, a lot of sprite that we bought, we didn't actually equip to anybody, so we needed to do that really quick. Anyway, back to the fight. We need to find a Scarly. I'm not sure what those they are. Maybe this guy's a Scarly here? Oh shit. Combo. Let's just do a Cyclone on... Oh, this is a Maloompa. See if we can't one-shot them. Oh, oh, we can't. Okay, well, we'll just do the, uh, what's Phantasm Break? Causes, uh, attacks everybody. Let's, let's just see what it does. Ooh. So it's like a, basically just like an aerial attack on everybody. Oh. Let's do the momentum kill on them. Wow, we got a lot of items from that. Because we kill everybody with like momentum, which is awesome. I like I like doing that. I'm assuming we just gotta keep running through here until we find like whatever we're looking for. Scarly or S Starly? I wish I'd be able I was able to take them all out with one shot. It's not though. Man, this weapon looks so dope. Um let's just have Nadir do an aerial strike. It's really cheap. And he should be able to kill everybody with this. Boom. Damn! That was nasty. Sweet. Let's keep it going. This is a dream team right now. Setsuna is a little too weak. She doesn't have that cure, and I do like that, but... I feel like... What we have now is really good. I think until we start fighting monsters that, like, don't take much physical damage, this party is probably going to be pretty effective. We need Setsuna and Kura to catch up. They're four levels behind. I really don't like that... The game sort of took them out of our party for a long time, and they didn't actually gain any levels after that. I guess we'll be able to get on top of those things until... On top of, like, the ice things until, like, we actually get the dude who's gonna show us through. What are these guys? I haven't seen these guys yet. Are these Scarlys? Yeah, these are Scarlys. Cool. There's a lot of them, though. So maybe we'll be able to actually find the thing we're looking for. Nope, that didn't kill them all. Let's do... Double back. The user assumes the stance upon receiving a magical attack from NG. Okay, so we, we gotta use that whenever we know a boss is probably going to do like a magical attack. So I probably didn't need that yet, but... Um, we're just gonna do- I'm just gonna do the aerial strike and see if I can't attack all of them. Oh, I missed the ATB. My mistake. Marara, oh, we had the Marara Sprite Knight. Alright, we got three of them, actually. Can we just keep running and try to find more? Oh, that just actually took us completely out. Whatever, we're gonna go right back through then. Black Cougarette. I actually maybe am uh, an idiot for <laughs> leaving, because I think all these guys are gonna be back now, yep. Whatever. We can do a little bit of a grind. I'm fine with that. Um, Phantasm Break. We can do that here. Oh, well, let's... Let's let our thing go up. Our ATB gauge go up. I was trying to do. But, man, these guys are murdering us right now. And there, just do your Cyclone real quick. Oh, no, we need to do our effect. So that we heal everybody. And then let's just do the phantasm break with these guys then. On these guys then. Boom. Their attack was done down. Wow, that actually was pretty effective. I'm gonna do the cyclone now and see if I can't kill them all. There we go. No, not that one. Oh wow, he missed. Yo, that sword really does make his evasion go up. That's awesome. Oh, I should murder him. Wow, she actually hits like four times when you hit that ATB on her... ...on her uh, regular auto attacks. Not auto attacks. But her regular attacks, period. Cool, I think we have the things we need, so we can go back to Royberg and, uh... Ah, oh, damn, we used the charge. I thought that was actually... what's his face? Let's do aerial strike on this guy. And let's just do the Cyclone and hopefully kill these guys. 
Oh, they didn't kill that guy up there? I supposed to hit everybody. Nice. Oh, so I guess if we're like within 10 damage or something, he's still an, an exact kill. The guy had 75 health, and we needed like what? We needed we did we hit 82 or something like that. Let's oh we gotta kill that thing. No! Kill it! No! No! Can we not hit this guy with with regular? Uh, let's do the demi. Hopefully these guys aren't sprite net infused. Oh, we got him! I don't know if that does anything for us, but... No, let's just do the cyclone. I don't think we need that. Let's have him attack. Oh no, we didn't kill him. Oh, his attack went up. All good. We're still gonna die, dude. Zato konomanana. Slippery high? Did we get anything specifically from the owl? I know, like, the first time we saw one of those owls, it was black. And then it kind of, like, ran away. Not exactly sure what it is, what it was. Yeah, let's get our cyclone on. Murdering these dudes in one hit. Ah, oh, did we do it? Yes! I love it. Only one shot, bitches. I feel like we got stronger, though. No? Cyclone has unscathed power, too, now. Cool, cool with that. Not sure what it does for us, but good. Good on us, I guess. Hermit's Ginger. Let's head on back to Roydberg now. Uh, if we walk down here, I think there's another thing we can get, right? Yeah. Sunset Citron. And then let's see if we can not now save this chick, Julianne. I don't know if we're gonna get into any business here with that dude who's trying to like who doesn't like us but everybody seems to be full health our turn is missing a bit of MP but she's gonna level pretty soon um, so I'm not gonna worry too much about that um, let's just uh let's just go ahead and advance the story let's, let's just talk to them usually I is simply tired due to this inconsistent combat of late at least that's what I believe. Well, let's check what be in tallies and see if these guys have anything for us. Tempering items. We still have Mithril. We can the weapon to roughly one fourth of its maximum stats. So I can buy a Mithril and temper it with my sword. Well, let's let's just go ahead and try it. Let's try one. We have we have the money, right? Um, and let's see if we can't put it on his Demon Slayer with the Mithril. What does it do? A physical attack to max? Physical defense to its max? I don't know what that means, but let's try it. It says use item to strengthen the weapon. Oh, we can't, I can't use it on this? Oh, who uses Mithril then? Why is it not letting me? I don't understand why it's not letting me do it. Hmm. Do I have to do it here? Or we just buy the Mithril. All right, I'll have to look into that and see why we can't. Just strengthen the weapon with the things we just bought but anyway let's go ahead and continue to advance the story i feel like all we did was just like run around and fight monsters for now i do want to show you guys a bit of story before you finish this episode here all right we're back you got your stuff madara sprite knight so that you gave the madara sprite knight to the uh magic sort of oh my incredible you found one thank you now we should be able to save julianne Wow. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Why is he like talking like that? Um, will you just give us the medicine for Julian, please? Sets us putting her foot down there. Oh, yes, right. Sorry, sorry, I got a bit carried away there. Here it is, as promised. 
So you get medicine from the magic sort of member. Sweet. It's very hard to make, which is why it's so valuable, you see. Come on, come on quickly, we need to go and give them give Juliana medicine. I guess Lilith is gonna go up there and uh, head us off first. Let's sell our stuff here. Let's see if there's anything that we can buy. Any magic items that we can buy that we weren't able to get. A sprite knight, I mean. Let's obtain some sprite knight. Okay, we got. We can, we can now get this Radiance thing. Creates blast that causes special damage to all nearby enemies. Used for Endear. Oh, sweet. Let's get that. Radiance. Cure. We have that. We've seen Cure too. We've seen all the rest of this stuff, I think. Stop. Arrow Strike. Blow, blow Counter. Yep. Train. Osmo's Life Force. Destined Cycle. Have we seen this? Yeah, we've seen that. Stone Shield, Paralysis Shield, Regen Leaf. Yeah, we have everything. Alright, I'm just gonna equip this Sprite Knight quick to uh, end here and then we can bounce. Shock, I haven't used much. But we do have, um, I think by this number of like stars next to the name here, I guess that means how much uh, um, ATB momentum stuff we've attached to it. Life Force Logic we haven't used. This is magical. Um, Destin Cycle? Avenger. Fluxes. Yeah, we have. These are. Sorry, these are fluxes, not ATB stuff. Just fluxes. Magan, Avenger. We haven't used Avenger. Transforms enemy attacks and destructive power. I feel like that's so good though. I kind of don't want to put it on him. Cyclone, we don't want to take off because it does a lot of damage. It's kind of like our go-to move. Imagine we haven't used. I don't think we necessarily need it right now. So let's just try Radiance. And just see what it what it will do. Shock? I feel like I could take off too. Blast crash dramatic energy causing physical damage to all the like And then we just the target. Blast causes special damage. Special damage. I don't know what special damage is. Whatever. Let's go see what's going on with this chick now. Who goes there? It's this fucker again, Cornelius. Oh, travelers, it is you! What is the matter? I see. So if she takes this medicine, there's a chance that she will recover. Yes, Cornelius, we have no time to waste. But... Can't pretend not to notice. She's a god otherwise. What's insolence? Inexcusable. It's true. You must have... Oh, there's something about strange about her. You put her to study by as the real duty and gravity disappeared. Please, change her back into the Julian that everyone loves. Very well, will you give me the medicine? No, don't give it to him! He's going to fucking- he's gonna do something. He's gonna like... He's probably gonna smash her or something, I bet. I throw it in a fire. Oh, he gave it to her? He actually did, nice. Good guy. Uh, my head! To the end. Lilas? Your Highness. Cornelius? Uh, where am I? No, I know. No, I've seen all of you before. Do you remember what you did to me? <laughs> I'm sorry. I do not. What is it that I did? You like blew me. Like you almost blew a hole through my stomach, I guess? You, uh, you struck my head, yeah. Gave it a little, gave it a nice little stroke. <laughs> That's a little weird. Let's see.
So you don't remember much of anything that happened recently at all, then? Does it be offered my sincere and humble apologies for any inconvenience I've caused? Oh, don't worry about us. You're good and rested up, then show the one you're back to your old self. I'm grateful for your kindness. Julianne, please take care of yourself. You're irreplaceable to all people here. You're like a beacon of hope to them. Thank you. So I gave your words upon my heart. Do you have anything to add, Endear? What? What? Come on, we're leaving. Ask us, ask him to take us across the ice. Of course. I owe Julianne's life to, to you. I shall do everything in my power to assist you. I'm sorry that I do not recall this after everything you've done for me. But tell me, so where do you next tend to, intend to travel? Uh, well... Not the last lands, perchance. Huh? How did you know? I see. I thought you were no ordinary travelers. For you to be journeying with such capable companions, your destination could only be the last lands. At any rate, I shall take responsibility for seeing them across safely. You rest, Julianne. Is she gonna come with us, though? Come on. Come, shall I be your guide? I shall be your guide. Finally, time to get going. Please, Seth. Please take care of Julianne. Maybe we'll just run into her later. In some games, like, you, you don't get people in the party. It's, like, much later. But we've been playing this game for quite a while, I think, and I'm surprised we haven't gotten all of our party members yet. I'm, unless I'm just completely misunderstanding and she's not actually going to be part of our party. So pray for your safe arrival in the last lands. Okay, I'm going to try to talk to you, man. I talk to her. She's not going to talk to me? No, I guess not. I guess not. I bet, I bet she's going to run after us or something. Do we need anything else from Weppy and Tallies before we leave? We have $20,000. Should we just go ahead and buy this stuff? Librarian staff. No, they're too weak, man. We're not going to use them yet. I feel like until we absolutely need them, I don't think we really should worry about them at all. Um, do we need anything else here? Maybe another potion, another tent? I don't have any mid others. I don't think we need them, though, yet. Let's buy another couple tents. So we have them. Bounce out of her. Alright, let us get going on our way. The journey continues. Like this. Wait! Julianne, what are you doing here? You need to rest. No, I'm fine. I. I wish you to take me with you on your journey. I knew it! She was joining us! Oh, yes! Yes! <laughs> You've only just recovered, didn't you? Sure you're up for it? I should become a hindrance to you. You're free to cast me off at any time. We should go to the last lands and see the truth with my own eyes. I, th I think she's actually going to try to be like a person who completes the mission. Why is Cornelius with her? I don't really understand the deal. What his what his deal is and why he's with her. She, she seems to obviously be a good person. See the truth. See see the truth. What truth? Uh, what truth? To the kingdom you mean? See the kingdom you mean? What truth? Sorry, I was messed up with his voice there for a second. I wish I, I wish to know the true reason why my kingdom fell. Pilgrimage's final destination is the son of the old kingdom. I cannot believe that it's a mere coincidence. It is said that ordinary people cannot reach, cannot even reach last land, so I must go therefore there myself. For myself, the only thing that I do already know for certain is that a great power dwells there. The royal blood that, that flows through my veins tells me that it is so. Oh, so she's part of the old kingdom that was at the last lands and then disappeared. I will change you to say it. I don't know if the source of that power is indeed what brought, brought my kingdom to ruin. I ought to my man some more to battle without being absolutely certain of this fact. The lives of my fellow countrymen hang in the balance. Julianne? 
So to summarize, your goal's different, but the destination's the same. You want to come with us? Well, why not? It won't make any difference to our journey whether she comes along or not, right? What do you think, Ender? Do what you want. You have to earn your keep. Hey, my, I owe my life to you. That's such a really ass risk it for you in combat. No, no, Julian, there's no need for you alone to risk your life. Da da da. We all look out for each other and we all protect each other. That's the sort of journey I want this to be. Very well. Your right is my command. Talk about formal. It's important to be able to take it easy sometimes, too, you know. You're a fine one to talk with, man. <laughs> They're gonna be fighting all the fucking game. I love it. Now this, I apologize for having caused you concern. As you've heard, I'm to accompany them on their journey. Why is she, like, just leaving? Don't, doesn't she, like, isn't she, like, the commander of the knighthood? Like, don't they need her? I shall return, but in truth, that is a promise. And together we shall all strive towards the true restoration of our kingdom. Very well. These people are worthy of your trust. You must place it in them. Thank you. You're truly a good friend. Ha ha ha. Friend. Uh, yes. Right. I suppose that's enough for me. Please look after Julianne. If there's a guy, I know... I know I need not worry for your safety. Julianne, enjoy the party. Sweet! Yes! Oh, yes. Oh, she's level 17 with these guys? Man, so maybe she just joins as, like, the lowest level in the party. What? But what does she have, though? What does she have to offer? Uh, I'm going to look through Julianne's stuff and just see if she has anything to offer. Can I now buy anything here for Julianne? No? No, it doesn't look like it. You buy the crown for Setsuna. I don't think I want to do that yet. I'm not going to buy any weapons for them. Okay, so we got to go across the ice now. And then we are going to be off to our races here. Hermit's Ginger, sweet. Alright guys, unfortunately though, that's going to have to be the episode. We're getting a bit long here. I think we're running around 33 minutes already. But uh, guys, I really, really appreciate you guys watching. I hope you're enjoying this game, because I really, really am. Um, it gets an old school JRPG, and like this is kind of what I grew up on, you know? It's kind of what I, I learned to like, like sort of Japanese content from. Like Japanese games started, and then like I started watching Dragon Ball Z, and then like, now I'm into anime and all Japanese culture, and like um, it started with these kind of games right here. So I'm thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying it. It's like a blast from the past but guys i really really appreciate you guys watching my stuff if you like my channel if you like the episode if you like the content please try and support it by doing all the social things like subscribe and share depending on where you're watching i post it both facebook and youtube every single day at 2 p.m on the weekdays i do not post on the weekends anymore but i'm trying to get more content out for you guys during the week so you can get your binge on through the weekend um but guys i really, really appreciate you guys watching again thanks thanks thank you so much for watching my content we will see you in the next episode of i am setsuna peace